What's going on, shady people? Welcome back to our amnesia playthrough. We are picking up right where we left off, literally. Uh, we cut off the speaking scene, which made me sad. I think we did all the controlling that we had to do. Because we got this to match, we did that, we did everything in there. So I think we are supposed to go back now. I think we are. The way we did in the last episode, we went back and we lowered something, so it seems right. Back in the cistern, the purpose of the inner sanctum has always been to study the orbs and find a way to force them to yield their power. However, he was still unaware of this. So that's the purpose of the inner sanctum. Wow, okay, I'm terrified. All right, so we can run across here, and we have another new area to explore, and that is the cistern. This is the actual cistern. He waited for his eyes to adjust to the darkness, but no shape or contour appeared. Oh gosh. He's semi well lit in here. Oh, here we go. You're conserving water from the spring. Yes. Oh gosh. You use me to control the water in the drain sewers to some extent. Also, it can be used for all sorts of purposes. Like the drinking. Hey, well, that too. But mostly to run different machines. Oh gosh. Ah, like water mills. Exactly. I'm dead. What am I hearing? Well, I'm guessing the water caused me pain before, so I don't want to go in it again. Can you jump up? No? Well, the water's not causing you pain anymore, man. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm free. Is the water really not causing me pain anymore? Can I walk around in it? Why did it cause me pain before? Oh, maybe the fish bit me. That's probably what happened. All right. Well, I think I have to... I still have to try to do this. There we go. Got it. Oh, a treasure chest. Yes. Oil and tinder. Those are the best of both worlds. I love how well lit this area is. It's making me feel very safe. I hope that's not like a lie. Okay, what was that? Redirect sewer water. 7th of August, yes, I love when he reads. There is no denying that Alexander puts a lot of faith into what I can only describe as magic. I'm not surprised. Even while traveling across Europe, I assumed I would have to embrace the supernatural to save my mind and life. As a novice, I do everything in my power to stay focused and not dwell too much on my own doubts. Alexander woke me up early and told me it was time we got started on our work. He was obviously excited to get going and we headed downstairs to the old dungeon where he preferred to attempt his rituals. It turns out that Alexander is a true renaissance man, paralleled only renaissance by the man. Sure. He showed me several rooms fitted for specific research, such as anatomy studies, alchemy, and botany. The crown of Brennenburg must be the inner sanctum, a most hallowed ground where we shall attempt to permanently banish the orb's shadow. Wow. I feel like we're getting so close. Was that a mistake? Oh, that was a mistake. I felt safe. I felt safe. And I have no oil. I felt safe for a little while. Not anymore. Great. Moaning. I love how the whole atmosphere had to change. All because of a stupid mistake. Oh my gosh. What's on the ground? Nothing. It's- I'm not in the dark. You shouldn't be getting all scared. Gotta get that rope. Attached to a rusty chain on the ceiling. I still haven't used this wooden crank that I picked up. Can I, can I, can I bust? I'm always going caveman style, trying to just bust the chains and... Oh, it works! Oh, for once! Just don't fall in the water, man. Oh, 
Oh, great. That's what I want to do. I want to touch another one. 8th of August, 1839. I could never be certain until today that I was on the right path. Using my orb, Alexander managed to channel its power unto us. The inner sanctum flared with blue, fiery light, and I could feel the same things I felt in the dark chamber in Algeria. It was like standing in a mad whirlpool of impressions. It was terrifying, but Alexander kept calm and wielded strange tools of science in order to tame the storm. Suddenly, the blue light was stained by strains of red, and the walls burst with pulsating tissue resonating. That's with like the what scene. we see all the time, the gum. Alexander quickly covered the orb in some cloth, and the unspeakable thing vanished. Apparently, the orb's shadow is closer than Alexander thought. He said I should prepare for a warding ritual tomorrow. Oh, man. I'm not sure what he expects, but I have a bad feeling about this. Oh, man. Here we go. Let's change the atmosphere of the room again. Doesn't surprise me this time, though. Oh, my gosh. This is also we can probably go to that other part of the game where the water's too deep. So we have to do all this to backtrack. Oh, I'm dead. Oh my gosh. How bad am I dying? The wound is bleeding quite badly. There you go. Are you serious? I just used one. Yup. You've got to be kidding me. Did the last note? 9th of August, 1839. It is still early, and Alexander is busy preparing for the ritual later today. Seeing him this worked up makes me question why. What does he stand to gain? I realize he is curious about it all, but surely there must be more. Is he so foolish he will attempt to tame the power of the orb? I must admit that yesterday, when Alexander flooded the inner sanctum with blue light, I realized we had but graced the orb's true potential. This might turn out to be more than escaping a creeping shadow. It might be the beginning of something truly extraordinary. Where is the other... Come on, there's supposed to be another thing I'm supposed to twist. There it is. Am I still bleeding? Oh, man. This stinks. I'm dead. I'm so dead. Here we go. What is this woman in the background? I'm never going to make it past these things. so nervous right now. I just want to find the beginning. I want to go back to the beginning. I don't want to turn around. I don't want to turn around, but I have to. Oh my gosh. I'm wasting so much oil. I'm wasting so much oil. What was that super jump? What is this, Halo? Come on, man. Come on. This has to be the way. Nope, it's not. Great. Great, 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 great. Where is the beginning? Where is the beginning? I'm done in here. I'm done. I didn't. I did what I had to do. That's it. Can I go back home? Oh, is this home? Yes, we went home. The blue light blinded him as it had done inside that murky tomb in Algeria. It was just as enchanting. He tried to approach it, but the Baron's firm hand held him back. All right. So I personally think that a couple things should happen. One, this thing should lower. And it still doesn't. Uh, okay. Or, I think that the water should have receded. Oh, great. I'm dead. I just killed myself. Did the water recede? The water did recede. But I'm 100% dead. There's nothing I can do. 
Barely conscious. <coughs> yep, I understand. A falcon of stench. Going further without a vaccine would be fatal. <coughs> Just stop wasting your oil and die already. I've never died in this fashion. This is interesting. So I don't have a vaccine yet. I need a vaccine. I'm barely conscious, but I'm climbing ladders. It'd be really cool if I just fell off and that's how I died. Just while climbing the ladder. Alright, this thing won't lower yet. Oh my gosh, I feel like it has to. So we gotta go back to Waterland. We gotta go back to Waterland. This is not Splish Splash. Any area that I missed? Right over here. Wait. The voice went silent. There's someone in here? Oh gosh, I just got chills. So there's definitely something else for me to do in here. Great. Already did that over there. Oh, this music is terrifying. There's nothing else to do. Also going insane. Oh no, it says I'm crystal clear. Oh, but a wound is be bleeding quite badly. Okay, so so I, I have natural regenerative regenerative uh, properties, which is pretty cool. Which is pretty cool of Daniel, you know, on his uh, evolution grind. I can dig that. Yeah, see, like we were over here already. I don't I don't think there's anything else to do in here, but I. I thought the natural progression would be to go to the next part of the game, uh, like, where the water was. But I don't have a vaccine. And if there's no vaccine in here, does it backtrack even further? I guess? I don't want to backtrack even further. Maybe now that I stopped the voice, I can do something. There's someone in there. There is someone in there. You guys probably just heard me swallow. That's how nervous I am. <laughs> I don't want to play, Mom. I don't want to play. Oh, oh, is that Tinder? Sweet. That's awesome. Oh, great. As if you weren't wounded enough already. Oh, that's not what I wanted to pull up. My bad. My bad if you guys just saw my steam nonsense. All right, what does my health say now? A wound is bleeding quite badly. I'm crystal clear. So why is the room getting all crazy? If I'm crystal clear, why is the room getting all crazy? Come on, man. Come on. My fingers are so bruised. <sighs> all right, so I have to backtrack even further. Is what I'm, I'm guessing. And I can only go... Into here. So was there something in here that I'm missing? Was there something on the left side that I haven't turned on yet to make that... That doohickey drop down? I mean, this is the control room. So... It would have to be... These are all locked into place. Okay. All locked into place. And these are all here. We got a hammer. Can't even pick up the hammer. Are you kidding me? We can pick up the hammer. Okay. 
So we have broken steam. These are all locked, I'm assuming. Oh, they're not. Wait, what? We already did that. Unless you can only do- WHAT?! That just scared me so much. When that broke. I really can't explain why. I thought we already did that! We definitely already did that in the last episode. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I didn't do good enough. Maybe uh, the game decided that I wasn't worthy. I'm not entirely sure. All I know now is I expect this to drop. There we go. Thank goodness we backtracked instead of wasting any more time. Keep going. Don't, don't play. The bridge is stuck and we'll need a push to dislodge. Are you serious? Like everything, every I love it. Everything is something, which is really cool. Oh great, that jump hurt me. All right, we're gonna go back to Caveman. Okay, that did nothing. Can I climb this ladder while holding this? I can't. All right, that's up there now. There's no way that's what we're supposed to do. There's no way that throwing a cinder block up here and then grabbing it and then This is not gonna be the right thing. I'd be shocked. Are you kidding me? Oh at least the cinder block stayed up there. Woo! Need a push. Thought that would do it. What does that mean? And we'll need a push. Glass jar, hammer chipper, hammer and chipper, carpenter's drill. So how am I supposed to push this thing? The bridge is stuck and we'll need a push to dislodge. I feel like I'm so close, so close to progress. Don't jump. I'm just grabbed that ladder immediately. Did not want to jump again. All right, let's try one more time with this. Maybe we just have to throw it against it instead of trying to throw it down top. I really hope that this is the right way. I'll be. I will feel so accomplished. I feel like it's not though. It has to be something in here. You can't bring things from another room. I can't go and grab that giant pipe thing. Again, again I did it. I'm intelligent, I'm intelligent. <sighs> this is unbelievable. All right, let's try this. Don't let go of it. Okay, you don't need a push. That is a push, that was a push. I have never seen a push so push-like. Oh, that, now that one works. You need two. You need two on top. Got it. The morgue. Oh, no. Come on. No, 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 no. The red taint burst from the walls as if they had begun to bleed. He cried out his fear as Vex will begin to consume the blue shimmer. This is not what I want. And I'm almost... The whispering. Here we go. Do you see, Daniel? It has yielded. What? The shadow. For now. Come, let's get this out of here so we can get some peace. Yes, let's. Where to? Just down the corridor, to the morgue. Are there more dead men there? You did well, Daniel. Come, let's get going. So I did well doing something, and I said more dead men. So I've already been involved. 
Oh my gosh, this is ridiculous. We have a note right here. And I think we're going to go ahead and read this note. <clears throat> Plague outbreak. The strange deaths among the servants and the prisoners have finally been resolved. It seems that the drain sewer, which has recently been opened up for use as a means of transport, is plagued by a peculiar poisonous fungi. The victims seem to have suffered an extremely quick outbreak of sickness affecting the entire body. Some of my men, including myself, are blissfully spared by this calamity, but it is clear that this is that this cripples my progress. The prisoners die quickly and their contaminated vi vitae lacks the energy I seek. I shall immediately start working on a vaccine. All right, so vaccine. The vaccine enabling my men to work in the fungi-ridden sewer is a definite, definite success. Unfortunately, only a few of the servants have been remedied as the procedure proved difficult. The others will perish, and eventually I will have to create more of them. Create more of them? Note that an injection of vaccinated blood will work as a shield long enough to pass through the sewers without any risk of infection. It will do fine for prisoner transport. All right, so we need to inject ourselves is what I'm hearing. I feel like I haven't opened up drawers in a long time. I feel like I have not opened up drawers in a long time. Oh, yes. Whoa. <gasps> this is my favorite. I fear for Daniel, for he is reckless. He is tainted by the approaching shadow and will not be able to pass the gate. Will he be able to accept this in the end? My love, I've seen evil in him. How am I to trust him with the truth? What cruel irony that I have to do... What? That I have to do unto him what... Agrippa, Agrippa did unto me. What? I'm so... So I'm evil. There's evil in me. Close that up. No one can know. No one can know of my dastardly deeds. The body's still stiff from rigor mortis and it can't be older than a day. I hear you breathing, Daniel. Do you hear me? Have you changed your mind? What is going on? Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Viewer discretion advised. Oh my gosh, this is terrible. I guess we should have expected to come to this point. And there's just eerie sound in here. Just give them a chair. You guys shouldn't be laying down. Sit down. Alright, that's terrible. Alright, so I need to find something to take this guy's blood that's been older than a day and inject it in myself. I'm sure that's what I have to do. Oh gosh, here we go. Found a copper tube. What happened? Why are all these dead? Where am I? What's happening? Help! Anybody! Help! That's me. That's Daniel screaming for his life. Surrounded by dead... Oh my gosh, this is ridiculous. Can you let me pick this tinder up, please? This sound is ridiculous in my ear. Three days now. This is ridiculous. Why doesn't someone go to this room? Hey! Anybody! Am I all alone here? Help! Help! I'm so tired. If I sleep, will I wake from this nightmare? If not, I pray my heavenly father will take me in my sleep. Oh my gosh. So this is probably the room that I was in. All these dead skeletons. I mean, all these skeletons. Skeletons are bones. They are inherently dead. No, don't kill her. Oh my gosh. Cannot penetrate the skull. Oh my gosh. There's something missing. How come we cannot penetrate the skull? 
Oh gosh. Oh my gosh. On that terrifyingly disgusting note, we're going to end the episode right next to our good friend, the donor. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, be sure to show some love to that thumbs up down below. It really needs your touching. I'm going to get the heck out of here and reevaluate my entire life. Have yourselves a good day. And above all else, can't go wrong with our plant buddy here. There's nothing we can do. This is great. We're and the needle's on top of this thing. I'm already dead. I'm already dead. He hasn't got hit once!